Well, hello. Uh, welcome to this an elegant stream. Yes. Um, we're going to be playing using OpenAir MU. And can't really find a nice way of um, changing the screen. So, yes, we'll have to see how we get on. Uh, right, let's switch. Oh. Oh, I clicked the wrong thing then. There we go. Okay, so... It's supposed to have the chat in there as well. I don't know why that's not showing. Oh, maybe I do. Because it's not a hole. Oh well, you won't see it on the video, but here we go. So we're just going to blast through f five or six games, mostly mostly combination between the Atari 2600. There's going to be games that I've never played, so a bit of a learning curve. And uh, yeah, we'll see how we get on, shall we? So... As you can see, we're starting with the Atari 2600 version of Alien. Yep, it looks a bit Pac-Man-y to me, but let's uh, let's see how we get on, shall we? Ah, I wish I had more than one screen as well. Here we go. Right, so. Let's see what happens. Hello, Nutty Cluster in the chat room, by the way. Oh, that's disappointing. We've got no noise. No noise. So. Why is that? That's because I need to add um, one of these. Told you it would be an elegant, didn't I? What's going to happen now? I mean, you might not want the noise. I've heard Tyree games before. I... Ooh, ooh. Nope, still no noise. Oh. Ah. Oh. Cock. Tell you what. There is noise for you, just not for me. We'll get there in the end. Let's do monitor and output, shall we? Turn my speakers down. Right. Let's try again. Oh, still can't hear it. Imagine there's like a whack a whack a whack a noise. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna get to it. Not quick enough. Dag nabbit. I'll tell you what I've found as well with this is that the, um, the pad that I'm using is really sensitive. And I found myself like, overshooting places and it finding it really difficult the games that i used to be able to play all right uh, I'm like that then going backwards so I, I, oh god see oh i'm gonna i'm gonna oh oh what the shit's that oh i'm playing frogger now Oh, and yet I can't move from side to side. That's a bit rubbish. Um, 
consult chat room. It says they can hear noise. Come on, come on. Oh, not quick enough. Come on. Gotcha. So I'm going to... Um, going to turn it down a little bit because apparently it's really, really loud. Oh, shit. There we go. Dead. So I don't remember this. I used to... We're playing these games pretty much because I used to have an Atari. Um, but I don't remember this game. Let me see. If I change my headphone settings, maybe... We're going to have another crack at this. Oh, I can hear it now. Yeah, it is wacka 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 noise, isn't it? Pretty much. They've just... Oh. They've just reskinned the Pac-Man. See, I can't make him go up there. Too sensitive. Or not sensitive enough. Or something. I'm going to get that this time. What was that? Is that just pumped? Right, well, once we've used our lives up, we'll... Uh, We'll switch to something else, and then somebody probably can tell me how to do this elegantly. Because um, I can't... Basically, I've, I've already picked what I'm going to... Oh, come on! Um, because then it's easier for the screens. Oh. I feel it would be easier for me to switch between the fucking pack. Right, okay, that's enough. So, we're going to... Uh, that didn't last very long, did it? Hey, what's going to happen when... Um, I'm going to have to pick other other ones. So, let's stick with... 2,600. And, well, at the moment, what I'm going to have to do is go into the scene and change the window. Is that what everyone does? I know it sounds like I'm talking to myself, but it's like this is there's got to be a better way of doing this. Cause now I can't I can't find the window that I want. Ugh. Here we go. Right. So here's a here's a weird one for you. Communist communist mutants from space. Truly is. Um, this is Space Invaders. Pretty much. Only, only harder. Oh, God. I feel I'm going to be saying cock a lot tonight. And the thing is. I'm not streaming this telling you that I'm good at gameplay. I, I used to be quite good at these. Obviously, I've never played this one. But... Um... Yeah, when I used to play every day as a child. Uh, for hours and hours. I had the muscle memory. And I, you know, not quite as good as I used to be. Oh. I don't know which ones are the communists. But again, I've never I've never seen this one before. And at some point we will play games that I used to own. Can have a look through and see what I remember playing. Look that was shit, wasn't it? Should we try again? Right. So, this is from the 2600, and the 2600 was my first console. Well, if you, do, if you don't count the Pong Sports console that I had first, I think it was a Radafin. Um, so it was my first real Space Invader type console. Oh, shit. Do these ships have a shield? 
Where's the chop? Um, so, to be honest here, I don't remember a lot of games that I had. I mean, I remember playing Yars Revenge a lot. We might have a crack at that later. Um, and spent a lot of time on Raiders of the Lost Ark, which was rock hard. I won't be playing that during these sessions. Cause, uh, by Jiminy, that was difficult. Before it rebuilds a whole lot. No, oh, they get it. So we can check on the ones falling in. really hammer it to get to that one at the top the, the communist the main communist I don't know uh, well that's just space in, uh, it's Galaxian kind of isn't it it's a Galaxian clone so uh, let's close that window and pick another I told you I told you it'd be random we're just going to be um, jumping around all over the place let's inelegantly change the uh, thing again All right, so we got, I, I did pick a couple of um, Atari 7800 because I, I never had one of them. Um, and we're looking, what are we looking, late, late eighties after after the um, after the video game crash. Uh, so I thought it'd be cool to check some out and see uh, see what the 7800 offered gameplay wise and graphics wise. Well, Double Dragon. Hey, punchy kicky game would be my guess. Go. Oh. oh, I thought I was playing then. Oh dear. What have we got? Kick. Oh, no, kick me right in the face. Oh. Let's try some punches instead then, shall we? Head butts. Oh no, I'm not very good at this. He's rock hard. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, to be honest with you, I am just um, button punching, but he's, he's proper slapping me, isn't he? Girly slaps. What have we got? Have we got an up button? No. Wow. Slap, slap, slap. I don't think I'll be playing this one very long. Look at him getting the shit beaten out of me. Oh, at last, one of them is dead. I mean, taken off to hospital or something. I don't know. Although this was back in the day when people died. Don't like that sl slap movement. Jesus. Is that a bit of a headbutt as well? It's uh, not what I expected graphic wise from a uh, from the 7800. I don't know. I suppose. Oh, my dead. 
don't seem to have lost any life. Is it time based? Though? Some people had fond memories of Double Dragon. Not this version. Do you know what? That was too difficult for me. <laughs> I'm. Uh, I'm quitting. I'm quitting. <laughs> Not rage quitting. I'm just quitting. I'm done. Uh, let's let's pick uh, one of the other ones that I've got lined up. Because there are some really weird ones. Um, let's let's try this one. Food fight. Okay. Oh, I tell you what, it'd be better if I could get it in the screen for you, wouldn't it? So you could see all of it. You probably didn't see me getting slapped around a lot. There we go. Ah, food fight, right. Intermediate, don't think so. Oh shit, I'm playing intermediate. Oh! What happened there? Okay. We're starting at level one. Eat the cone. So... I, I don't know of a game that's uh, like this at all, but whoop, there you go. And that's 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 this game by the looks of it. You uh, you race to the ice cream before you can. Oh, I don't know anything. Look, custard pie. It's, it's an Atari custard pie. Quick, eat that cone before it melts. Oh. Let's get moving. Uh oh. Ah. See what I meant about not uh, not being great at these. Oh shit. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Okay. We don't rage quit here. We just have fun. That's that's what we do. Just have fun. Oh. It'd be bad to die on the first level. There we go. Oh shit. Do you know what? Forget that. I'm going for an ice cream. Why did it turn blue? Did it turn into policeman once they're done? I wish he ran a bit faster. He got, got two ice creams now. Uh oh. Nightmare inducing that face, obviously. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Keep forgetting that I can uh, fire upwards as well. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get away. What the F and L have we got now? All very well having food to hit them with, but you have to actually hit them. Oh, I'm on a straight run now. Stra oh. Straight run, straight run, straight run. Instant replay? What's going on? Well, they didn't die, so I don't mind. Can you imagine if you'd done rubbish? Ok, 
Okay. Let's get rid of them all. And then see if we can... That was a good one. Whoa. fire down as well as I can fire across. Let's get whatever that is. And these are holes, as you're no doubt aware. Oh, I thought I'd got it then. Uh, which can fall down. I found out. That was a good one. Look at that. Now, I started with a pie in my hand, obviously for a reason, I guess. Oh! Uh, so, again, I don't, I don't remember playing this when I was younger. I've never seen it before. Um, I'm not trying to excuse why I'm shit at it. So we have one more go before we switch it over to something else. If I'd have thought on, we might have had a wheel. Once I get a more elegant way of switching games, we could have a games wheel and we'll pick the one we're playing. Do we have a run button? No, no run button. See, occasionally chuck some sideways. Oh, like that. I didn't want that. Yeah, I'm thinking in 3D and I shouldn't. I thought I could get behind that chef then. Oh, why is it? Oh. I think this, uh, before the... Be a lot shorter this game. Yeah. A lot shorter, and we're going to switch to something else. I have hundreds, hundreds of these, and it's like, you know, I don't even know what to what to pick. Uh, I do have one more that I've uh, prepared, or that I thought, ooh, let's play that. So let's uh, smoothly tra transition to the next game. It's clacks. So it's a tile stacking game. Um, I played mostly on the Jaguar. Obviously, this is the 7800 again. Um, let's see if I remember how to play. Oh, there you go. Three tiles in a row. Or in a column. Three together. Oh, what happened there? Oh, shit. See, I'm flustered now. Two claxes. Sound like the count from Sesame Street if I'm not careful. There you go. Three claxes. Obviously, the faster you get them, unless um, the less room or the less room you take up. Oh, these feel like they're coming fast. Why, why, what happened there? Oh, 
No, don't be sending them back. Am I doing something wrong? What's going on here? And the right pig's ass of that, haven't I? No! Oh. <laughs> what am I doing? Why is it going back? Is that just part of the clacks? Oh. Cock. We have no reds. Or oranges. Okay. Oh, I thought that was a clax. No, don't go back up. What the fuck? Whoa, red one. See, less talking now and bloody concentrating. Still doing shit. Oh. Ah, well. Oh, now I've got to get a diagonal. Three diagonals. And more colours. It's not frustrating at all. Do that? Oh yeah. Ha <sighs> right. Don't have any nice setups at all. Let's go for green. Oh no. Bugger. Bugger. Let's let's continue, shall we? Oh, hello, old average gamer. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. If you're an old average gamer, what's what's your what's your era? What do you? Uh, what, oh, what did you play? I'll have to remember I'm doing diagonals. Oh. What do it by doing that, will I? Stupid. Ass. No, I don't have anywhere good to put any of these. I think I found, I think I found my, oh, bloody joypad. Yes, I'm blaming the joypad. All right. Maybe. Oh, why do we want white? Why? Can I build a three? Oh. Nope. Oh, I'm full. I'm dead. Ah, an old acquaintance, eh? With a pseudonym. Who would be... Who, who, who would be an old average gamer? Do you know what? Do you know what? It's not the 90s. And I'm done with clacks. <laughs> ah, you see. Back in the day. Like. The 80s day. Uh, we could play these games for hours, but this day and age, I've just, I tell you, I've got <laughs> no attention span at all. It's like, no, I'm done. I'm done. Uh, so the other console that I had, um, I, I, I traded in my Atari VCS, my original Atari VCS. I traded it in for a ColecoVision or a ColecoVision if you're American. But I always called it ColecoVision. And um, there was all sorts, all sorts on it. And it had arcade 
quality graphics and it was so much better and it came with um plugins that plugged in the front you could have like a plug-in steering wheel and um they, they even had a plug-in computer but one of the things that sold it to me was an adapter that plugged in the front and let you play atari cartridges so all my old atari cartridges would work in this clicker vision and um can you imagine that now can you imagine like the new the switch the switch lets you play microphone uh, xbox games no no playstation and xbox coming together no i think clicker vision got sued just saying but you know um right let's uh well we've done the games that i'd opened to try and smooth the transition uh we've we've run through them so uh i'm i've i've moved to to the clicker vision which is why i was talking about it and we're gonna just um we're just gonna play some random random clicker vision uh if you know of any clicker vision games or anything like that just um hit me up in the chat and we'll uh We'll play some, but let's start. Let's start with one that's pretty much um, arcade quality. Um, back in the eighties, arcades, obviously. And we're gonna go with. No, we're not, because I can't find the window. Ah, oh, there's, there's got to be, there's got to be. A simpler way of doing this. Show windows with empty names. There we go. Let's see what we've got. Boom, boom, boom. No, can't see it at all now. I'm a scrolling past too quick. There we go. But now you see, it's all tiny in the window. Let's make it bigger and then just stick it in here for you guys okay keyboard for this one let's play one let's go I don't know how many people are old enough to remember this but um oh bugger I didn't get the oh cock um yeah you have to get the bonus in order you have to get the b first and shoot the pipes got a high score so let's just wipe these out there we go i can concentrate on the yellow ducks now he says getting eat by yellow ducks um so you got oh You've got uh, bullets along the bottom. Every time you shoot, you lose one. Obvs. And you have to shoot everything before your bullets run out. Or the ducks eat them. Oh. Do you know what? I'm struggling to get my eye in. No! <laughs> there we go. Oh. I mean, would you believe I used to play this better as a child? I know, right? You just get into a rhythm and it gets... If you, if you just get out of that rhythm, you're buggered. Let's just... Uh... Sorry, I'm not concentrating on the chat room like I should because... Uh, ducks, you know? Ducks. No, 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 oh, assholes, come on. <laughs> gotcha, you bastard. Let's have a look. Game from the Atari all the way. Wow. Whoa, can't catch it. Oh, well. 
And then it's rinse and repeat. Can I get that beat? Oh no, no beat. Get the door, come back. There you go. Go! Concentrating on them pipes, you see. I was better at this in rehearsals. Oh, I ran out of bullets. Let's just have a quick look. Went from Atari to Commodore 16 to Spectrum 128. Well, ah, right. Mega 600. So I had a slightly different path. I went from, from Radofin, like we mentioned. Uh, Atari VCS, Collector Vision. Then I don't really... I, re I basically ran that Collector Vision into the ground and my next actual console console was a Mega Drive. But we had like a family spectrum that we used to, I used to play on that a bit. Um, but yeah, then it was Mega Drive. And by that time I was a Sega person. So I never, I never Nintendoed until GameCube, I guess. Oh, a, a Game Boy. It, so handheld console wise, um, Nintendo was just, just the best one, wasn't it? So, um, I think Carnival's quite repetitive. Let's uh, let's scotch that. Pick a different one. Um, I did see. Say, you know, I, I should have put more thought into it, really, shouldn't I? Because I've got hundreds of games. Uh, I just don't know what to. Uh, which one to play? And some of these, so the um, the ColecoVision used to have uh, what's called a super controller, which looked like a you fit your hand in it and it had four buttons, a joystick on the top, and it had um, things like Rocky Super Action Boxing, and each button did something different. Uh, and yes, I do have them in a box. Uh, Waiting, waiting for the studio to get finished. And then we'll have a bit of a retro gaming. This is why this is why this is happening, you know? Um Oh, I tell you what, should Should we play a really well I mean this was the version that I played all the time, but um Star Wars the arcade game. Um, I currently in the process of getting my two, two of them, <laughs> both my uh, Star Wars, the arcade game, uh, arcade games uh, out of storage. Um, and one day I'll get them serviced and they'll work and things. But uh, yes, this was one of the, the one of those games that I was... I, I had to own it. I just had to. So uh, it was one of my earliest eBay purchases back when eBay started. And I was stupid. Uh, but this is the ColecoVision version. Um, played an awful lot. Like, um, before I could own arcade machines. So let's see. Let's see. I'm probably... Not going to be great at this, but used to playing it with a, a yoke, you know? Ah, uh, of course, easy. Oh, it's upside down. That's going to fuck with my head. Right. Oh, it's going to so fuck with my head. <laughs> Jesus. I'll be lucky if I can just get the fireballs. I wonder if I can... No, I can't... Um... 
Oh dear, dear lord. No, I can't. <laughs> Only if I should play it upside down. Crap. Oh. Didn't even shoot a TIE fighter. Very disappointed. So in the arcade game, I don't know if people know, but if you don't shoot anything down the trench, which I don't know if you can in this game, is it gonna, no, you can avoid them. Um, if you don't shoot anything going down the trench and then get your missile in the uh, in the hole, um, you get more points. It's just more difficult and you lose more shield. Oh, oh, we're coming. Oh, I missed it. Oh, no, I didn't. Hey. Doesn't say any points for using the shield, though. Uh, for using the force, though, then, does it? Oh, no. I might have to get a, a yoke gamepad if we're gonna be uh, if we're gonna be doing this regular. Oh. <laughs> well, at least I got a tie fighter this time. Right. Oh, we're doing towers. Are we okay? Oh no, I keep forgetting. Down is up. And up is down. Oh. <laughs> Tell you what, it's a lot easier to play on the arcade machine. There we go. Just don't move. Don't don't move. Let the tower come to you. Let the tower come to you. Oh, I missed that one. Oh. I mean, at least it tries to do the... Um, the Star Wars theme, which is good, you know. Oh, I do not. I don't think there's any point in me trying to shoot because I'm not going to bloody hit anything with these. Oh, avoid. Uh, so obviously, in in the arcade, this is a this is a vector game, um, which is a lot more difficult to do in uh, on a console. There is only one. Vector console, as far as I know, and that was a Vectrex. Um, I do have an emulator for a Vectrex, and at some point we might cover that. Um, oh, here we could be at the end of our uh, shields here. Gonna hear R2 in a minute. Oh, we would in the arcade machine. Oh, come on, come on. No, oh, I got one. Go on. Dead now, though. <coughs> Is it going to go off before the... Right. Do you know what? I've done more than I expected. Like I say, I'm not a gamer. I'm just here for having a bit of fun. Uh, and uh, if we make it a regular thing... we've not We've not established a proper time yet. But if we can make it a regular thing, and if you want to have some fun as well, watching me, I don't know. I've been watching other people, and I think it's quite fun. So, And if there's anybody out there that's got any hints, um, not obvious hints, yes, I know about the background and all that sort of shit, uh, but I'm using OpenMU. Is there a better one? I'm looking at getting um, an Ultimate Mister and then feeding that into a capture card. So that might improve it at some point. Uh, so there we go. That was uh, that was Star Wars the arcade game. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. Ten more minutes, and then we'll call it a nice round hour. How's that? Uh, unless you you want to carry on. Um, oh, Super Cobra! I remember playing that as a kid. Oh, is it just starting? Oh. That one just starts as soon as you start it. So I'm not playing that one. I need to be able to capture the uh, thing. Ah. Oh, yeah, tapes. Yes. I remember them copying them round school. We had a tape which was which was a C90 that had, like, I don't know, 20 games on it. And you had to um, zero the clock, forward it on. Oh, that's when this one starts. You know, that sort of thing. Oh. 
Those were the days. Okay. Depending on how how good or rubbish I am at this, this could be our last game of the evening. Uh, we might have uh, a couple of cracks at it. Let's see how we go. We're still on the collector vision. Uh, for those of you keeping score, this one is Konami's Time Pilot. Okay. Hmm. Are we getting any... Uh... Oh, there we go. To the keyboard math. Ah, one second. Okay, obviously, yes, skill one. There's a fire button. Oh! It's that one. Okay. Oh, another dodgy controls. Oh! Oh, shade. Okay. Ah. Oh. I mean, I don't want to sound like I'm bl <laughs> blaming the controls all the time. It's it's just a case of getting used to them again, because the collector vision was joystick based, but this is. Oh, do I need to get the little man? Yeah. So we're in the biplane era, as you've no doubt aware. Oh, crap holes. Um, and I believe with Time Pilot, you um, travel through time. I just need to kill two more of the little bleeders. And then, uh, look, round in circles when I'm, all I'm doing is pressing up and down. You can't ride into the blimp can't you just can't is it gonna let me play it again or do i have to restart Shh. <sighs> let's restart boom i've got to have another go at that Do, 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 do. Oh, see, all the I, pu I pushed right and went round in a circle. What's that noise? Stop concentrating. I'm concentrating again, so I've stopped talking. Sorry. Uh, I feel we must be getting. Ah. Oh. Must be getting ready to change year. See what? What was that? What was that? Tried it again, didn't I? I I'm going to avoid that. Maybe, maybe take it from behind. Just saw it then, but he disappeared. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! He's going to shoot me. Boom! Can't avoid it, avoid it, because you've got to use it to travel through time. Don't mention the war. 
So you're a bit faster now. With your technology. Oh. Where's me? Oh, did I miss my parachutist? Oh, no. Ooh, ooh. All these people in these, all these pilots in the green aircraft are going, what the fuck is he doing? Going round in circles. See, is that, is that the blimp version of, uh, do I need to... Oh, that's the blimp version of... Oh, avoid, avoid. There we go. Where are we going to next? 1970, but it's Vietnam. Oh, bloody Hueys. Not the ones with the news. We were big on Hueys in the 80s, weren't we? Oh no, why? No, the circle. It's bloody control. I believe with the um, with the ultimate mister, I might be able to plug in the actual controllers from a ClecoVision, but bloody hell, once you've seen them, I know I played it a lot as a kid, but geez, I'm not sure I'll be able to control it as well now. Oh. Ganged up on me. Well, oh, no, I said that was probably the last game. I feel we should end on. I tell you what. I tell you what. Let's let's do this, shall? Oh no, let's do. Do let's do do. Yes, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do, Mister Do. Um. The thing is, I have to be careful that I don't do all the good games straight away and then uh, have nothing for future streams. Although I do have lots of other consoles and games to play. We could be here years if you wanted to join us. Um, just, just follow us. Follow us and then whenever I go live you'll know. How's that? I don't know what Twitch people really say. It's not a sub smash the subscribe button like type thing. I'm not going to be saying that. You're going to be here or you're not. Let's play some Mr. Do. I'm going to have another problem where I can't get my bloody joystick to do what I want. Oh, I missed him. Assholes. See, I wasn't going right then. I didn't I didn't mean to go right then. There you go, it's gonna squash at least one of the bleeders. Uh oh. There you go, get them all, get them all! Oh, I only got one, disappointing. Oh, I'll come back to those two, I'm gonna be disappointed. Oh, I'm going left and right and left and right and I. Tits. Ugh. I don't know. Um, 
I do notice that the chat has disappeared from the video. And I've probably just clicked something I shouldn't have. So, apologies for that. But I am paying attention. Ish. Oh no. I've lost my ball. It's too late. It's gonna have to go. You see, this is a big number two. Sounds like the magic roundabout, doesn't it? Obviously, some of you might not be old enough to remember magic roundabout, but you see, and what they've left in the little hole, some shreddies. Hmm. Everyone likes a shreddy. Oh, I ran over it when it was an E. I've already got an E. Oh, bloody asshole. Oh, nearly squashed me then. Squash him! Get in there. Is he gonna go to. Whoa! Shit. And you'd be surprised to learn. Yes, this is a big three. Oh, I peaked too soon. Wow, the cunning. Girl, went the wrong way. Oh. Oh, I got the last chair. I thought I died. <laughs> oh. Can't go any further than that. Come on, my pretties. Stay there. That's it. Oh, oh. Ah, oh, that wasn't what I was expecting. Holy fucking shirt balls. Well, I've now promised you an hour and we're slightly over, but I can't see that I'm going to survive much longer. Oh. No, I want the R. Give me the R. Magic roundabout, magic roundabout. I know I should be aiming to squash them all with uh, apples and shit, but let's just get as far as we can, shall we? There's a lot of moon coming around here, isn't there?
I mean, I don't know why I'm using, not using the ball more often. Oh, look what I did then. Stupid. Oh, you see, we might get to level six. Nice. See, I wonder how much that I'm kind of suffering because I'm used to playing with a joystick, an actual joystick rather than a D-pad. And I wonder if that's... My thumb's just on the wrong place on the D-pad or... Look, look, I'm going back the wrong lane. I didn't want to do that. And now I'm stuck. I'm stuck pushing an apple. Ugh. Nope. What? Oh, oh. Down, down. There you go. It's going to drag it on a little bit if I get an extra life in it. Ah! Ah! Look, look, look. <laughs> oh, well. Ah, I think we'll call it a day. Um... As of yet, this show doesn't have any intro or outro music. Um, it's just to see if it would work. And kind of does. I'd like to smooth it up a little bit and see, you know, get these transitions working better, perhaps. But um, I think that's going to do it for our first uh, visit to Snug Radio's Retro Lounge, which I think we're going to be calling it. Um yeah, it might not always be games, but it'll be mostly games. See? Uh, so, big a big shout out to everybody in the chat room. Thank you for joining us for this first one. It's been great seeing you. Um, and come back next time. Okay, well, that's it. Until then, till we meet again. Have fun. We'll be back later.